Yeah. Go ahead and make an open statement, Coach. Then we'll. Yeah, I mean, uh, I think we just gutted out a tough, tough win. Um, you know, they were coming out for us big time, and I think these guys just did, did a great job on both ends, but especially on the defensive end, especially the last ten minutes, just clamping them down. I think they, I think they were up thirty-nine or forty to thirty-seven or something like that, close. And uh, and they scored ten points in the last ten minutes, and uh, I think these guys just did a great job of of clamping down on them and, and finding ways to get stuff to get a W, and that's what it's about. Uh, Dana, talk about this. Uh, you know, tonight, third time playing this team, and a little bit different than the first two games. Really nip and tuck game there until you guys took hold. So just kind of what changed in that last you know fifteen minutes or so? Uh, I think it's it's obviously never easy to beat a, a, the same team three times. It's, it's a very difficult feat. That this is credit to this team and our toughness. I think the one thing that really changed the tide down the end is when it was 39-39 and we just we got together as a group, got together as a unit and just said, like, this is our game, we need to go take it. And our toughness really showed down the stretch. Ben, uh, just talk a little bit about, you know, the team hitting some shots there in that stretch. When it's 39-39 and then pull ahead and very quickly hit, get ahead by seven, then stretch it to 10. A couple of deep looks uh, from Henry and a few others. Just talk about that stretch of time. Yeah, you know, it's great when we have so many people that can do that and, and we're not relying on one person, you know. Tonight was Bats Night. We all knew that and we got him the ball. And, you know, that's why we were successful. Uh, last time we played them, it was Jarrell's day. We got him the ball and that's why it worked. And, you know, just this team being unselfish. And at the end of the day, it's about the win. And all 16 of us know that. Um, and when we have that first in mind, that, that's it. You know, that's our goal. Sean, second unit came out there and really but kind of held serve in the first half and then second half really clamped it down. And you're talking about keeping a, a top 20 team in the in the 40s, 50s, so very, very late in the game. Just talk about some of those exchanges and with that second unit out there and just not letting them score. I mean, the biggest thing about coming in as a second unit is not getting your foot off the gas pedal and always making sure that you pick up where the starting unit left off. And defensively um, is biggest of all, like the whole, the whole entire part of it, that's the biggest part, um, playing defense and making sure that um, that sets the tone and we keep building off that and we keep uh, mounting pressure, mounting pressure, step on the neck and essentially just going for the kill. And that's a big part about uh, coming in as a second unit. And Dana, back to you, the, the just that not flinching when Kaz said it got to 39, 37, they had a little bit of momentum. You know, just talk about that moment of not flinching and what you all felt in those next couple minutes? I think the maturity of this team really showed in those moments. We've seen a lot this season, and, we've, and it's a lot of the same guys were here last year, so we've been through a lot together, and uh, I feel like we truly have the confidence in one another and our coaching staff and just and just, just together as, um, as a unit to, to just make the right plays, and that, that helps us get wins. Coach, um, great win, um, but this is not the regular season. It's the playoffs. You, have, you don't have a lot of time to prepare. you got a big game tomorrow. What are you going to do against uh, the big kid on the other team? Six well, you, you know what's you know what's funny is you know this is our schedule all year. You know, we play back to backs, we play tournaments, and we play our conference schedules uh, Friday, Friday night, Saturday afternoon. So we get a little bit more rest tomorrow. So that's great. And uh, you know these guys just talk about our resiliency and our toughness, and that's what this whole team's been about. And it, it starts with the guy right, way down there, Sean Chamberlain, who uh, is an inspiration to all of us here. His his toughness and his resiliency uh, permeates through this team, and, and all these guys uh, um, um, really, really exemplify what that is about and what we're about, and I couldn't be more proud of all of them. Yeah. Can you talk a little bit about maybe with the tradition you have? I know a lot of guys, when they come out of the game, they come and give them high five, and it seems to keep everyone in good spirits. Um, when did that start? Well, I, I think this what, what it is is there's really a, a true, true, true brotherhood amongst these guys. You know, in, in all 16 and, and throw Sean in there at 17, they just really, really love love each other and they wanna they wanna play for each other. Whether they play zero minutes or, or 30 minutes, they're gonna do whatever they can to help our team be successful and help each other be successful. And that's you know the true um, true test of a great team. And, and they've 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 done that all year long, and that's why we've been successful. Yeah. Just wanna ask the. Yeah, student athletes, a question. Um, what does it feel to have the crowd um, in this game and helping you um, call a victory? You know, it's awesome. This this was our spring break. Um, first day, we, we really didn't know what the crowd was going to look like. We had great crowds the last uh, couple weekends we were home. Um, and just to see everyone rally, stay here, you know, get behind us, it just gives us that extra motivation to keep going, keep fighting for each other, get that extra day, get that extra week of practice to work together.
Great, Joseph. Great. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you so much.